Okay, good morning guys. Uh, this is Tapan Shah aka Neo Hack T signing in and I'm making a tutorial. This is a tutorial video which I'm making for upgrading your firmware Bada OS firmware to Bada any of the Bada OS firmware to Bada OS 2.0. So I will show just now I am using DDJK3 for my 8530 so I'll be showing it so okay we go in general settings general and I'm very sorry not in this I'm very sorry for that okay and about phone and use the system info 8530 bada 1.2 ddjk3 okay so I will be coming out now so I would be upgrading my phone to bada 2.0 firmware the latest release which would be released today itself by samefirmware.com so I would be upgrading it to that so what I would be doing now I will show the procedure how to upgrade it so no, if anyone has many users have queries for upgrading to Bada 2.0 so all the queries would be solved so first of all what I need to do is I need to switch off my phone okay so I'm switching it off okay okay it's, it's been switched off now okay so okay so now what I would be doing I would be just taking out the cable because it charges like this so it automatically gets charging okay so first of all I need to okay I'm very sorry uh, I just forgot to show you something First of all, you need to check that whether your phone has a SIM lock or a network lock. So for that, I will show you the code how to do it. Okay. So there's a code for it. I will show you how to do it. Uh, the code is just let it start. Starting. Okay. So go in the keypad option. Okay. Star hash. Seven four six five number is sorry, it's five uh, six two and five and then hash. See you get over here is natural clock off, subset lock off, SP lock off, CP lock off. So that's done. I will be coming out now. Okay. So I don't have any SIM lock or network lock because if you have there would be a problem in flashing. So do not do it if you get on. Okay. So just use your network firmware then. Do not use the open source firmware like Open Europe or Open India or something. Okay. So do not use that. You can download the firmware files from samfirmware.com or I will be also uploading the firmware to my site if you want Bada 2.0 you can download it from samfirmware.com also and after the same firmware release it I would be uploading it to my site that is like it's not my site and the author over there and the moderator so it would be www.baradownload.com so what I will be doing first of all I need to put this phone into download mode for so for down putting it in download mode what I need to do is I need to press the down volume button okay I, can, I need to do it from by two hands so I will be doing it like this so you can see it again it's a down volume button the lock key on the right hand side right the lock button just press it and the red key button so it will be going in the download mode okay you see it's in download mode now it's very simple it's in download mode the phone is in download mode that's very simple I would repeat it again how to do it press the down volume key button then on the right hand side you have the lock key button press it and then press the read key button here like from the button you hang up the call okay and sim as simple as that so press these three keys simultaneously and the phone would be in download mode within like two or three seconds okay now you what you need to do is 
I need to open, I need to download a, like a multi loader. I have the multi loader already downloaded it, so I would have put a link on my website. You can download it from there, okay, or also from www.samfirmware.com. So I would be opening the multi loader now, okay. The multi loader is open. You need to use 5.65 version, it's version 5.65. I hope you see it now, okay. So then tick on the LSI, see the LSI only tick LSI nothing else then tick full download okay nothing else now you need to have the boot files first so for the boot files what I would be taking I would be taking the BADA 2.0 files boot files so for BADA 2.0 the files are this okay this is a new version 8530XPKG6 it will be released today so you guys will be having it by today uh, 14 p.m. Amsterdam time according to CM Fonger. so this is a boot files click it ok ok it's over here see kg6 the boot files again the AMSS files I need to what I need to do is I need to go in BADA firmware this is the path XPKG6. Okay, now I got the EMSS files open. Okay, then the APPS. This is the APPS files. See, then RSRC1, RSRC1, RSRC2. I've got the RSRC2. Only one option, mid option. So FFS. CSC file now. I have the CSC file over here. You'll be getting all the files in this uh, firmware. You would be downloading this is the last file SHP app. Okay, so this is the file. Double click on it. All the files are set. So all the files are set to upgrade your firmware. This is an upgrading tutorial. Many, I have many questions that I need to upgrade 2.0. What should I do? And this is upgrading procedure like you flash a normal firmware so nothing more okay so check all the files like it's xpkg6 so check it all okay everything is perfect okay from my point of view is everything is perfect rsrc1 rsc2 csc and ffs csc everything everything is perfect now now what we need to do you need to connect your phone first of all it's in download mode you need to connect so what I would be doing I would be connecting it where is okay here it is okay so just just bear with me can't do with one hand so. just a minute I'm connecting it okay okay it's connected now see it's connected I connected it to my USB cable see Okay, now after connecting it, you would get this COM19 ready. Okay, after as soon as you connect your handset to the laptop or PC, you would be getting this that your handset is ready. It's in COM19 port, and it should be ticked. This should be ticked. Okay. After that, you get this option port search. Okay, port search. If this you are, it's not showing this, you can do port search okay it would be uh, searching any of the ports then. after that you need to have you need to just click on download okay so everything is set I would be clicking on download now okay so here we go download okay it's starting now first of all it would be resetting my handset it would be restarting it for a minute just, just, just for a second okay it's restarted see it's restarted now it's it's happening over here see dbl erase wait reset okay I will, okay now the flashing has been begun see it's flashing now everything is flashing now so bada 2.0 has been flashed like it's going on on my handset the apps file now and now the rs rc1 file is been flashed so everything is going smooth so just do everything what I said and the process this flashing process would be too smooth for you okay 
so not to worry. Nothing will happen to your phone, believe me. <laughs> so again, I need to wait. Yeah, just seeing the screen like this uh, until the process has been completed. It's almost 10 minutes now. So come on, come on, man, come on, do it fast. I only have 7 minutes and 50 seconds now to record this because then it would be auto cut off. So need to record again. So, okay, so you'll be getting everything in this. It is flashing, flashing, and flashing. It's still 18, 14, 19. What I can do is I can put just put just camera over here. Now it's not being you, you will not be able to see it. So let's do it this way now. Okay, buddy, oh my god. Uh, I can't cut the video just now. I thought of cutting it, but I can't cut the video. So. Damn. Sixty-nine, seventeen, seventy-one. So, guys, you would be yeah. That's the news for you guys uh, who are seeing this video today. Like Sam Fungar is releasing a new release that would be eight five three zero XPKG six. Just now we are flashing it, okay, on my handset. So it they will be releasing by it's by today itself. But like by 2 p.m. Amsterdam time, okay. So, to get it, you can also get this firmware. Uh, as soon as the same firmware would be releasing it, I would be releasing it on my website. Like, I'm the author and the moderator chat on the web on a website named www.baradownload.com. Do visit it, you'll be getting many things from there. I am there, I am a chat moderator, so I would be available in the chat for like Saturday and Sunday. These two days yeah, I would be available, so I have an off day, so I can afford that. Come on the chat, you can ask me questions, if you have any queries, I would be there. Visit www.baradownload.com Okay, CSC file has been flashed. Now, after this only one file would be remaining it would be uh, shpapp it's a long like it's a large file so it will be taking some time maybe i think so oh my god it's still five minutes remaining i'm waiting for it to be flashed man come on wait fast Regarding this firmware, I would be also be updating uh, change logs on my site, and also Sam firmware would be updating updating the change logs. So you can see there, and you can flash this. This is a most stable version. It's I, I can say at 95% stable version. So you can use it in day to day, you know, in your day to day use. So not to worry. Though it is a beta release. You can use it on day to day on your handset. Okay, the final firmware is your not yet been sorry. Okay, so the final final firmware is not yet been released. So but you can hear a glimpse of Para 2.0 by this firmware. What would be coming ahead? Okay, it's six percent. Come on, man! I only got three minutes left. It should be hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry, man. Okay. Going on, I'm bored. I'm just seeing my laptop screen, and because sometimes it goes in the screen server more, so and the lights are off, so it just not happen. Ah, <sighs> man. It's 11 person now. Okay, I'm making this video for 
Sashant, the administrator of the admin of this site www.baradownload.com is somewhat busy in his personal works so he asked me to do it so I hope this time you will you guys will not regret the video quality because it's better it's better I need to do it this way okay guys and like two minutes the video would be cut off okay so I would be recording it again I need to record it again so I will be showing the other things Mm -hmm, 21% see I told you SHP APP would be taking some more time it's very slow over here I marked I was marking it the last time I flashed like yesterday when I wasn't 2.0 so. okay it's doing oh my god Two minutes for two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. <coughs> it's going on. So, when what I would be concluding this video, like when the SHAPP the file has been done uh, here, in here, yeah, it would be written all files downloaded or completed. Okay here it would be written like all files downloaded or completed so your firmware has been flashed then what happen then what will happen that your phone will be restarted a blue screen would be coming on and it would be initializing some commands after like 30 40 seconds your phone will be restarted it by itself do not touch your phone it will restart it by itself and then you would be on bala 2.0 okay so i am concluding this video just now because after this I, I will only have the recording of like two minutes three minutes and I cannot upload it like for two minutes I cannot upload make a video and upload it okay so I will be concluding it the, this video over here if any questions you can ask me okay and also you have a flashing video I have uploaded a tutorial for flashing of the Bara handset before so you can watch that link too okay this is the procedure is the same is just I told you that it is a bar 2.0 because some newbies are just very anxious that I we need a new tutorial for bar new new bar 2.0 so I just made it but it's the same nothing more nothing less the procedure is the same for all the fashion okay so thank you this is upgrading procedure from your any of the bar OS to bar 2.0 thank you very much have a blessed day